guys, we just landed. We just landed. We flew here in a mom mom's car Toyota 4Runner. <laughs> better than a Jeep? No, no, never. There's no one? If we never better than a Jeep. If we would have took the Jeep, we would have been having to buy a new motor. <laughs> oh, gosh. We just landed in Ranger, Texas. Ranger, Texas. We're up on a hill, and we are going to a teeny tiny little air show. I'm overexposed. There we go. <laughs> teeny, teeny, tiny air show. We're going to show you all about it. It's not really an air show. It's more like a fly-in. People just fly in and hang out and camp. That's why I said we just landed here in our forerunner. Yeah, we don't have a plane. <laughs> not yet. If you get to work, sell some real estate, we'd have a plane. I'm trying. Dead burn it. Tell you what. Okay, we're going to go check it out, guys. We're going to show you. Comment below. Can I ask you a question? What? These pl I hate my hair. Okay, hold on. There, go. Okay, baby, can I ask you a question? Yes. Are these pilots going to be pissed off if I call these things coffins with wings? Yes. Because literally they're Just so tiny they look like coffins with wings. Keep that to yourself. Okay. Okay. On the yak. What's your favorite airplane here? All of them. Why? Because I have none of them. What's your favorite thing about this air show? Just seeing planes. Period. But like just seeing planes or like what? Like Talking to the pilots because they're cool. How many pilots have you talked to? Twelve. Twelve? Yeah, you were hanging out with the dudes from England for like eight hours. Giving them crap about using cannons instead of Nikons. Sometimes I like to wow people with my knowledge. I'm not just a pretty face, you know what I'm saying? There's some technical shears knit behind this face. <laughs> okay, guys. We're over at the car right now. There's a lot less to do at this air show. A lot less. It's not an air show. I'm, I'm not saying a lot more. You heard that correct. There's a lot less to do than I had anticipated. So, so to make this a little bit more interesting, I'm filling up our cup with something more interesting than soda. <laughs> It'll help me get through the rest of the night. It's not like, that bad. Here, hold the camera. Hold it's the camera. It's, kind of... it's not bad. It's not bad. It's just not good. I, I enjoy it. I'm glad you do, baby. Guess how many people I see over at the air show with unmarked cups, unmarked styrofoam cups. Pretty much everybody, you know what I'm saying? I think they feel the same thing I do. I don't know if this this clip is gonna make the actual film or not, but probably, probably not. I'm just telling you. So if you guys, hey, guys, I, I keep looking around, but I wanna make sure there's no like officials. But if you guys come to air shows, best friend right here, right here. It's not that bad. And I'm not even just like saying this brand. I'm just saying in general, well, some sort of, some sort of adult beverage. How many of those you had there, buddy? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's talk about that, baby. Okay. Literally, guys, we bought this on the way here. This is the first time he's given me a sip of whatever was in his secret cup. The first time. 
So I've had one half of one. Now I see why he likes air shows so much. Bet. <laughs> oh my gosh, now that he said bet, this, I might divorce him. So what do you think about this, Heather? I think this beer is cold, not cold and not flat, and it's flat. Do you like being out here at the air show? I love it. I love it. It's the most exciting night I've ever been to. Most exciting ever. So Shad and I were walking back uh, to the air show after Do after I? filling up our cup with some soda, some soda pop. They're not having the air show. They canceled it. What? And we saw these two sneaking out. We just filled up our drink and now guess what? We're going we're going back to the air show. That plane's take it off because they're like, this place is boring, we're out. <laughs> right baby? So not fun. I'm actually super fun. So right now, hey, I'm go see if you can I'm talk gonna to go hey, talk. Shh, shh. Go see if you can talk to Scott. Who is Scott? The guy that flies the yak. Oh, there's a pilot that I want to try to get on this hey, video, accidental. but he's too cool for school. Yeah, just walk over there he's and too cool don't for even school. let you know you're doing it. Okay, and then, but before that, we're going to go talk to this other pilot, and I'm going to see if he'll take me up in his airplane for free. <laughs> hey, baby. I think they forgot to attach some wires. Right there. I'm not going in that one. Okay, so... We talked to the pilot of the stupid biplane and Shad is making him take us up. So we're going up in this thing. It's like 200 years old. I'm probably not gonna live through it. So it's, it, it's probably equally as scary as the stupid asps from two nights ago. Just FYI. Um, Shad's getting in the plane right now, I'll show you. There he is. All right, let's roll. Okay, guess what? This plane is made basically out of paper and glue like I have heels on am I gonna ruin your thing no, they're you're wedges you're okay <laughs> bye guys oh yeah
just got off that plane. What, what, what are your thoughts? I'm glad we filled this up with our adult beverages. It was, it was actually super fun, but he's kind of a cocky mofo, you know what I'm saying? He had to like fly in formation with these other guys and show off what a cool pilot he is, playing with our lives the whole time. Meanwhile, air pockets of hot and cold air, that other plane could have crashed. We were like, what does he think he's like a freaking Thunderbird pilot? No, no, no. Hey look, that almost was our coffin. Now we, sh now, now look how he flies safely when he's not following an airplane that's two feet away from him. He's like, oh, look how nice and safe this is when I'm up here all by myself and I don't have passengers.